such a gentle human being, such a great friend, um, and an amazing talent. Um, we, we know her from Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Um, Bear, you know, Wicked. If you saw what other reading mask and you did. <laughs> I can just go through your whole reading repertoire because I know it all. But please welcome to the stage my good friend, Jenna Lee. So, yeah, we'll do it slow. I adore this boy, by the way. Um, I adore her. Like I said, we, we have known each other for a while and uh, we deal with each other's neuroses. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, I Me? got here. Well, I, oh, uh, you from Long Island? Me? <laughs> I got here tonight and I was absolutely freaking out at that. I've been, everybody, I think, everyone in this room could probably sympathize. I said, I've been dealing with allergies and this and that, and my voice is gone. And I think it's this insane desire to, to do just absolute justice to, to his music because I love it so much. And, and then I was sitting there and I had a drink. <laughs> always helps. And I'm listening to him and I just thought, you know what? It doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter. Because his his music, every song tells a story. Whether whether or not you relate to it, you know someone who does. And um, it's so beautiful. And I just feel so honored to know him. And every time he throws a song at me or says, come to London, I'm doing a concert, I jump on a plane. <laughs> I jump on 11th, Jenna. <laughs> so, yeah. with that said, uh, this song is called I Wish. One person knows it. <laughs> oh my god. Um, and it was, it's a, a song from a musical that I've been working on for 35 years and I'm only 31. Um, <laughs> I want to kill myself. <laughs> Next to Normal took like 10 years. I mean, that's how you have to look at it, right? Right? Yeah. Yes. So that I've been working on called Peace. And um, there, a lot of my songs have a lot of fairy tale uh, in them, and there's a reason for it. The, the character is a, a writer of fairy tale. So this is uh, her at a young age um, writing a fairy tale about her desire to go away to her school um, and uh, her mother not allowing her to go to this school. And it's called I Wish. And I'll be doing it slow. <laughs> slept in a tower for 17 years awaiting a prince she was told would appear his kiss had to be strong yet tender and sweet to awaken her from her restful retreat but when her mother the witch had caught word of the news that such a prince had arrived well she kindly she said, she'll stay in this tower, asleep in my hold, safe from a world with these dragons and trolls, and that's where she stayed for the rest of her life, safe behind curses, behind curses and vines. Well, I'm not She'll understand I 
Thank you, everybody.